Hey, what's up guys? So we are at the Clown Motel. We just got done filming last night. We're gonna be leaving today to go on to a new adventure. But first, I got a little prank on Omar. A couple of you guys know when we were in Vegas, we got to the hotel, Omar was so tired that he went and slept for three hours. While Omar was sleeping for three hours, I went and got a tattoo. Not just any tattoo, an Omar Gosh TV tattoo. Yes, that's right. Now, the funny part is this is just a temporary tattoo. It's taken two days for it to dark enough, darken up enough to look like a faded, jacked up tattoo of his logo. What I'm gonna attempt to do, and hopefully this works, hopefully he doesn't see the camera, He's upstairs editing right now in the room. What I'm actually gonna go do is place the camera, walk in there, place the camera down, and I'm gonna go tell him that I got a tattoo. And we're gonna see what his reaction is. And I've already set this up because when we first got to Vegas and we got to our hotel, Omar's like, hey, there's a tattoo place there. I'm like, oh man, I don't have a tattoo. I should get my first tattoo, an Omar Gosh TV logo. And he's like, nah, bro, don't do that. Definitely don't do that. And I was like, yeah, I know, I know. Well, he fell asleep, and that's when I went and did this. Let's go see what happens. Is you will find adult clubs everywhere, like every corner. Unless there's another one up here. I don't know, Sin City for a reason. Yeah. James has been like begging me, like, hey man, can you take me to one of the I... <laughs> Bro, I gotta tell you something. Remember I was telling you the other day like my arm was hurting and stuff? Your arm? Yeah. You promise not to be mad? Yeah, why? You want to see something? Your arm or something? like that. You want to see something? Sure. I probably shouldn't have done this. I got a tattoo. What? Omar Guy's TV tattoo, bro. <laughs> that looks like a shitty ass tattoo. Dude, you did a horrible job, bro. <laughs> they did a horrible job, dude. Are you serious? Yeah, Is bro. It? Yeah, bro. What the hell? Yeah, bro. They did horrible, bro. Can I get that covered up? <laughs> you even got the O over like a freckle. Bro. Bro, that's like the worst tattoo ever. Why would you get you making my name look bad? <laughs> that looks like... Bro, I've been dreading telling you this. What the hell? That's why your arm hurts? Yeah, bro. I had to wait a couple days. Bro, what the hell are you thinking? Are I you know, serious? Dude, I know. I don't know why I did that, dude. I thought they were going to do a good job, bro. That was your first tattoo? Yeah, that's my first tattoo, bro. And it's it's the genius tattoo I've ever seen in my life. That thing looks like 40 years old. Oh, <laughs> dude. What the hell? Bro, who did that? I would like... At the hotel, bro. Remember I was talking oh. about getting a tattoo and you're like, no, don't do that. I bro, did, did it you, anyways. Did you pay for that? Yeah. The hell did you pay? What? Remember I told you I had a secret with the fams and I asked them and, and I said they kind of... Bro. Bro, I'm going to get my... I'm going to get in so much trouble when I get home, bro. Well, you know what? On a positive note, like, don't feel so bad. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, my first tattoo is Jess. Hey, hey, look, though, they, they can touch that up, man. I, don't worry, they can touch that up. I, I think it'll be all right. Is it? If it makes you feel better, I'll get one, too, and we'll, we'll get, go to the same person. I got a good Bro. tattoo guy. You think he can fix it? <laughs> yeah, oh. yeah, no, he can fix it. He can fix it. <laughs> I just feel bad for you because you got to support. I mean, good thing you're not wearing any tank tops. Bro. Hey, he can fix it's that, so bro. It's so faded, though. Bro, what the hell were you thinking? I don't know. Why did you like... <sighs> I cannot believe you got that. Bro, you never get a tattoo. I thought it'd be cool, in. bro, but... but <laughs> why did I know it could be so jacked up? You know what I was going to do before this? Well, I was going to get your old one, the smiley face. Oh, that would have been like 10 times worse. You know what? I think you can get that fixed. You can get that fixed. Bro, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. You get that fake, bro. Don't worry. <laughs> you get. I mean, you can add to it and stuff. I don't know, dude. This is crazy. Did it hurt? Yeah, it hurt. What are you talking about? Did it hurt? Bro, what the hell? They remember when? Me? Remember when we got to the hotel and you went to go sleep and I went out for like three, four hours? 
That's what I was doing for three or four hours. Bro, that looks like a shitty prison test. Not only that, but then I spent like a hundred and something bucks on that. What the hell? Yeah, bro, I spent like half my money on that. Bro, bro. a guy in prison could have did a ten times better job than that for free. Oh, damn. Uh, no. Would they use a guitar string for that? Bro, I don't know. I don't know. And that's at the hotel. I know, bro. I feel bad for you. Thanks, bro. You know the only good thing, though? Is that it's just a temporary tattoo? Oh, uh, you recorded that? Yeah, bro. Oh, how did I see? <laughs> Got him! Bro, that, is that for real temporary? It's a temporary tattoo. They said it lasts like a month unless you start rubbing like some kind of oil on it and it'll go away in a couple days. Did you tell them to make that like shitty? Or they? No, they just did a bad job. Bro. Well, actually, what happened was they did a. Pre I'll show you some pictures of when they first did it, uh -huh. and they said you have to wait like two hours then you have to go in the shower rub it off but what happened was i did a live stream and i walked around and i sweated uh -huh. and it when i looked at it it was all smeared oh and i'm like oh crap this is not gonna work but Bro, I'm, they I'm said it gets thinking, darker every day i'm here thinking to myself like oh my gosh like did you really get a tattoo like i'm like feeling bad for you like, yo i can't believe that actually worked because i was so thinking you're gonna be like bro that's not a real tattoo that's a fake tattoo but it does look so faded and so jacked up it that it kind of like looks like i got jacked up yeah, dude, it looks like an old tattoo. Like, it, it, I don't know. You fooled me, bro. Uh, I thought they just used some bad ink or something. Or maybe your skin didn't take it. Yeah. Oh, that hey, worked bro, out good, so good. prank. Hey, good prank, we bro. got them, guys. It worked. And it was only 40 bucks. So it wasn't too bad. Hey, you, you got overcharged for that. I did get overcharged for that. But you know what? It was worth having this little video. Because I didn't think, I was thinking this ain't going to work. It's going to be too fake. It's going to look too fake. Yo, I could have did a better job with a pen. So. You could have. You could have. Hey, well, we got them, guys. That that worked out really good. Shout out to you guys for helping me do that. And uh, hope you enjoyed this little funny video. Yo, that was hilarious, man. Yeah, bro. Oh, man, that worked yo, so good. Me, you got me good. I was feeling really bad. I'm like, yo, I'll get one. Yo, your reaction was legit, though. Your reaction was like... Yo, you had, like, tears in your eyes. I, I know. I tried to play it as best I could. Like, yo, I was upset. Like, some water in your no, face no. I'm like, like really feeling bad for you, man. Oh, dude. <laughs> All right, hey guys, we got a lot of editing to do. We got Good literally break. more footage than I could ever imagine to do. Hope you enjoyed this, and I'll uh, see you guys uh, next. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed that little prank. It was fun to do, and it was possible all because of you guys. Without those donations, I wouldn't have made this. I wouldn't have been able to even spend $40 to get a little fake tattoo to play a prank on Omar. But hey, thank you guys again so much for donating to my PayPal. I appreciate it because I get that money right away and you can use it to make better films. I mean, I don't take that money and go and spend it on personal things. I don't drink, I don't gamble. I'm doing it 100% on content to make these videos for you guys. So thank you guys for helping make these videos. It's all because of you guys. Now, we have filmed, oh, well, first of all, I'm uploading this or making this little clip right now, right before I upload this. So this is in real time. The last two days we have filmed, actually last three days, we have filmed some of the most incredible videos you will ever see. And even Omar says they're the most best, they're the bestest videos ever. Anyhow, tonight we are at the most haunted hotel known to mankind. And I'm not joking, guys. Wait till you see this. Over the next couple of weeks, you guys are going to see some of the most incredible videos ever. I cannot wait to show them to you guys. But again, <laughs> excuse me, it's cold out here. But again, thank you guys for making this possible. If it wasn't for you guys donating to my PayPal, I wouldn't even been able to make this video. This little silly prank video. So it's because of you guys and the fam, our family, that is able to make these videos and make me be able to pump these great videos out for you now we have had horrible internet connection so you know I'm sorry that I haven't been able to do any comments or you know I barely even been able to post anything on social media but hey wait till you guys see what's coming up boy you guys are gonna be shocked hey I can't wait to show it to you love you guys and I'll see you tomorrow peace